On the subject of gas prices, they've now dropped for a record 89 straight days and now average $2.38 a gallon. That means drivers have a lot more money to spend on other things. Here's Manuel Bojorquez. $1.99, it's sweet. <laughs> Dallas taxi driver Gerald Caldgrove says he's saving $40 to $50 a week on gas. What do you plan to do with that extra money? Well, I've already, uh, I've already basically done it. I've given maybe two extra gifts to my five, five grandchildren for Christmas. Every day, motorists are saving $450 million on gasoline compared to prices in June. Forty percent of people in one poll reported having more money to spend each month because of savings at the pump. More than a third of those with additional income plan to use their savings on holiday gifts. Cheaper gas is also boosting holiday travel. Nearly 90 million people are expected to make a road trip, up 4 percent from last year. Lacey Patterson will drive 500 miles. I was not planning to travel, and just due to the changes and due to the allowances I've had with the extra money, I, I decided to make a trip. The savings go beyond the road. In Louisiana, shrimpers are paying up to 70 cents less per gallon. That adds up when you consider boats, like the ones owned by David Chauvin, can hold 10,000 gallons of fuel. What does that translate to uh, for your guys? The money in their pockets. We figured out it was the equivalent to probably a little over $1,000 in each crewman's pocket. By one estimate, cheaper fuel was the equivalent of a $75 billion tax cut for U.S. households. But James, with prices like these still falling, the cut looks more like $100 to $125 billion. Thank you, Manuel.